Hello everyone. How are you? My name is Tamanichi. I will be doing your reading today. This is for a collective of my Virgos. Before we get into the reading, please press that subscribe button and make sure you press the one to subscribe to um, all the little black button so that you can be notified whenever I am live. This is going to be for my Virgos today. So Virgos, let's see what it is that I have for you on today. First of all, I do see where there is an end in here. Something could have ended. Now we have someone here. Could be a Scorpio. I have Scorpio in a chart. You could be dealing with a Scorpio. Somebody is stuck in a rut. They haven't quite got over or trying to get over an end in here. Okay. Now you also have someone that's trying to think about whether they want to come in and offer you a higher level of commitment this person want to come in and offer you a equal give and take because this person do see you all as they wish fulfillment here or this could be you all going towards someone that you see as wish fulfillment virgos you could be dealing with scorpio cancer pisces i also see virgo capricorn and taurus here so let's see what we have here Yes, yeah, somebody wants you to let your guards down, drop your defenses here. Yes, they want justice. This person wants some type of karmic justice. Someone could actually want justice in the court of law. This is someone that you could have took a break from or took a break from you. Now this person is ready to act. But see, you all are dealing with someone that's impulsive and opinionated. This person used poor judgment. They overspend. They frequently take advantage of others. They always ready to start arguments too. See, this person will create problems if you don't set some boundaries. So boundaries need to be set. You have someone who have fully learned from their mistakes in the past and they are returning home. Now, I do see where y'all could have this queen of pentacles in your energy. This person is the type of person who have mood swings. This, you know, she changes her mood. She's narrow-minded and bigot. This person have an unforgiving attitude toward people that she look down on. She takes without giving. She gives only when something is expected to be gained. She have a strictly materialistic outlook on life here. Yeah. Now, this could be someone that you all see as a soulmate or vice versa. Now, someone could be seeing you all as being single, independent, and enjoy solo pleasures. But I do see where you all could have lost passion for someone. Could have had a false start, going through some type of delays or brutality here. Five of Cups here in the reverse. This is about moving on, forgiving someone. Hope is returning. Also, you have someone in your energy that could be recovering from something. Or you could be recovering. Now, you all have someone in your energy that's unpredictable, difficult to understand. See, this person is a quitter. This is an imposter. This person is not as they appear. This person exaggerates, tell little white lies, pretend to like people and talk behind their back. Spirit saying don't trust this person, but I do see the Wheel of Fortune where things, it's, this is about extreme change here. Also, with the Wheel of Fortune being in your reading, this is about good luck, good fortune, a turning point, even luck with gambling if you gamble. I also have a king of pentacles that's in the reverse. This person is jealous and they don't follow through with things. When having the same suit in this reading, somebody could possibly be married or be counterparts here. Someone would like to heal things. Maybe this king of pentacles would like to heal things with you. But the thing about it is this king of pentacles could have, you know, stepped out and was dealing with this um, queen of swords in the reverse. See, queen of swords in the reverse, this person is angry you know this person is cold-hearted dishonest this person is not kind at all nine of swords being in the reverse you know somebody could have been resting recovering or healing after some type of extreme torment so this king could have went through some extreme torment with this uh queen of wands here yeah now they want to compromise which you want you to compromise but you could have cut off communication with this person yeah but see this person see you as being very abundant but you could have had a fight or argument see somebody had too many options here or too many choices and commitment issues but i do see where you all will reject this person okay because you're dealing with obstacles here disappointment and setback see you're going to be exhausted from trying to accomplish something here it's going to be impossible for you to achieve what it is you want because it's simply not meant to be. So no amount of effort or determination is going to change this. Y'all going to have to settle for your second choice here. Let's see. 
Also, what I have here, this is um some messages from my hidden truth deck on how a person feels or what is it that a person may want to say to you. You know, I'm so attracted to you. So you all have someone that's very attracted to you here. Yeah, I lost myself for a little while. So, you know, maybe this person just, you know, blew the coop, you know. You and I were too young. So maybe this person feel that the reason things didn't work out, y'all was too young and didn't have quite the understanding that you have now. I feel you leaving me behind. So this person feel you leaving them behind. So this person is trying to hold on to you. I wish I could share my good news with you. They have some good news that they would like to share with you all or vice versa here. Let's see. I want you. So this person is saying I want you, but I left when I saw you with someone. So maybe this person saw you with someone or you saw them. Now I want to tell you how I feel. So you have someone that actually wants to tell you how it is that they are feeling here let's see what else we have here for you all spirit what other messages do we have here for virgo what is it that virgo needs to know here yeah you have romantic feelings your feelings are a real and worth exploring so you also have codependency here. Addictions could be affecting your romantic life. So someone could be dealing with addiction. Some of y'all are dealing with unrequited love. It's not enough, you know, attraction or chemistry to keep things going here. Yeah. Reconciliation. Someone from your past could, is returning to your life. So some of y'all have somebody that's coming back from the past. But see, Spirit saying you have to release your ex. Release your ex. The time has come for you to clear your energy. So, y'all need to clear your energy. Also, pay attention to the red flags. The signs are cautioning you. So, there's red flags that you need to pay attention to. I do see where you have new love here. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings here. Also, this is worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life here. So, I want to see Virgos who or what's in your energy field, okay? Let's see who or what's in your energy spirit. Who or what's in Virgo's energy here? Somebody that's on cloud nine. This is somebody that's always under herbal influence. You know, somebody that could smoke, you know, a lot of marijuana. <laughs> yeah. You got someone that's eavesdropping. This is someone that's a peeping tongue. They looking over someone's shoulder, listening to their private conversation. So, you know, be aware of that you also have a divine union here see this is a scarce union between two souls a divinely guided connection that's coming together where two people are going to be on the same team virgos spirit who or what else is in virgos energy you have an energy drainer you have someone that's draining your energy this person will drain you of your energy and everything that you have to give here spirit who or what else is in virgos energy you got a gold digger here, somebody that wants only money, okay? This gold digger is someone that's marrying for the money. You know, they marry people for money. <laughs> yeah. You got a role model here. This is being an inspiration to others, having positive recognition from a lot of people here. And I know, I see where some of you are, are very, very intelligent. Some of y'all are balling, okay, Virgos? Y'all having a luxurious lifestyle, you know, wanting having the most expensive things in in life. Y'all pockets are full. Okay, okay, Virgos. Let's see. One more for Virgos. Somebody is hooked, okay? This is somebody that's addicted to someone or something that you have in your energy. So, let's see. I'm going to get you an abundance card. See what your abundance card is. Also, y'all can have somebody that's going to get caught in the act. Somebody could possibly be getting caught doing something they have no business doing now with your abundance card virgo let's see what is it that virgos need to know spirit what is it that my virgos need to know when it come down to their abundant life what advice do we have for the virgos let's see spirit what advice do we have for my virgos let's see here okay virgos you need to block out distractions here see your life purpose your life purpose and other priorities need your undivided attention 
So it's time for you to take charge of your schedule and your working environment by turning off electronics and avoiding, you know, um, anyone or anything that distracts you from what's important. You already know what these distractions are and you have the power to responsibly block them out. Also, you need to several ties of poverty here. Dear one, there is no need to suffer or sacrifice. You need to hold the intention of undoing any vows of poverty, of, you know, denial that you may have made consciously or unconsciously in any lifetime. As you do so, all effects of these vows will be undone for everyone that's involved in all directions of time. I'm going to get you a love card today, and this is how I will end this reading here. Now, um, I will have more readings to come, so y'all just be sure to hit that subscribe button. But let me get you a card from my love deck to see what it is that you all need to know. Spirit, what messages do we have for the Virgos? What is it that Virgos need to know when it comes down to love? Y'all have... Okay, let's see encourage reconciliation here now with the encourage reconciliation if you are having trouble with your significant other i have just gotten into a fight and want to make up see this spell can help you need to pretty much it's like um 